Hello, this is Artifacts of Mars, and this is Disclosure, coming to you from the frozen plains of sunny western New York State, in Science Valley, south of Rochester, north of Hell. And I'm going to continue my series in this bizarre area. Uh, I'm hoping not to stretch it out to... <laughs> Four parts. It might go to three. We'll have to wait and see. Uh, so let's get started. Here's an unusual uh, set of structures in this area. I would say so. Let's do the roundy roundy thing here and see what we can find out. Utterly bizarre, other than definitely buildings of some kind I don't really know and if we had better resolution that I mean Google Earth on Earth you can go right down to the ground but I'm not quite there on technology as far as it goes this thing leaves a Cast a different matching shadow. Seems to be a typical type formation. And it's rectangular, so I seriously doubt that we're seeing something that isn't artificial. The question is why is the public not being told about this? Which, of course, they have no intention of doing. Now, let's take a look at this. Could these be crafts sitting on the ground? I can't tell. These three things right in the middle. Or are they just humongous boulders? You can make up your own mind about that. And I do have three stills that I've taken from this. I wanted to go over them in part two. Again, we have the more of what appears to be buildings right in this area. And I've already gone over small objects in this area, except that I want to show, like I said, the stills, and the stills has some interesting features. Well, when I bring down the, when I tweak the lighting, I can show more than I can here. This is the thing. So let's take a look at the stills. Well, notice how, notice how all the right angles suggesting of more buildings right there in the middle. So we definitely, uh, I believe this to be some sort of industrial complex. There's little things all over the place that look like buildings, not natural features. So we got a major, major area here. I'd love to get on the surface and take a look. Well, of course, I don't have that ability. Hang on. Okay. This one's going to be real hard to see, so I'm doing my best. Appears to be a rectangular object sticking right up. Almost like a sign or something. But it's not laying flat on the ground, it appears to be standing up. Maybe an obelisk or something? I have no idea. But, once again, I don't believe it's natural. That one's really small, it's hard to see, so 
I think I'll spend a lot of time on it. Generally speaking, I did tweak the lighting on this for clarity. Generally speaking, it looks like a very regular area. Some sort of office complex, perhaps. I don't know, buildings of some kind. I shouldn't ascribe Earth norms to it, because if there's a civilization there, they're likely to be entirely different than ours. Just looking at this, you should jump right out of your seat and say, hey, what the dickens? Alright, we'll move on to the next slide. I'm going to undo all this. I don't want to save it like that. Hang on. And I got to take the lighting down. This area is bizarre. It doesn't look like much from when you're up above, but once you get down the nitty gritty, and here we have these rounded, hollow objects. We're kind of horseshoe shaped and they're sticking up, almost like A frames, not quite. Is that bizarre or what? And they're kind of arranged logically and neatly. So there we have more buildings all over the place. And take a look at this one right here in the center. Again, more buildings, more rectangular objects. It's just incredible. I don't know how this can be ignored. That's why these people... hide stuff, they hide it in plain sight, and they simply won't deal with it, and they leave it to the public, and then public, you know, somebody like me gets called a conspiracy theorist, because I say I'm seeing things in the photos, and we get marginalized. Okay, I have one more to show you. Basically the same types of things. Organized buildings. Nothing all that great here. Same thing we saw in the previous ones, but I wanted to show the shadows because if you look real closely, you know, these are like overhanging roofs. But take a look at this. Bring out my arrow. It looks like a light under there. I can't think of anything else it would be. Which, of course, isn't supposed to happen on Mars. This is all crazy. There are things here that are just beyond belief. I've always thought that there was a uh, civilization on that planet, and I've thought that for a long time. Let me put it to you that way. Now, I got one more thing in this slide to show you. Um, there will have to be a part three. Part three, I'm going to deal with... Part 3, I'll deal with the lines that we see in the area. It's just unbelievable. Okay, this object right here in the center, I have great problems with that. Looks to me, I'm going to take the lighting down a little more. It's just kind of a blob, but it appears to be a building with large.
large windows if you look close. And there are all the things around it which don't look natural. We have all the right angles and the shadows that are cast. You don't tell me those are natural features? Uh, I'm thinking not. Something isn't right here. Now, there is a civilization on that planet, or at least there was. I think there still is. That's the way I see it. I don't know if tweaking it anymore is going to do me any good. So, when you see that these are buildings, so your natural features shouldn't be just hanging there with no apparent suspension apparatus. These aren't natural features, by and large. Some of them may be, some of them may not be. Definitely or not. This is a point. Well, I'm going to wrap this up. This is the end of part two. Expect a part three. Uh, whenever, maybe tomorrow morning. I had a lot of political stuff to do, so it can't help me up. I'm Artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching.